Hi, welcome to our channel True Up. Today, I am delighted to introduce a fresh topic about the future of Chinese photonic chips, Huawei chip genius Shinichen. Photonic chip development in China need the ongoing efforts and investigation of every expert and genius. Shinichen, one of the youthful geniuses, will be introduced today. His contributions have propelled China's semiconductor and chip sectors forward. This is when optical computers come into play. They've never worked that well, despite decades of investigation. Photons are more difficult to control than electrons. Photons, on the other hand, are ideal for some sorts of calculations, such as those required when leveraging an existing neural network to form conclusions. So, let us continue his tale. Shinichen attends Hangzhou Foreign Language School in junior high. He had a strong interest in physics at a young age and was completely enamored with it. He got accepted to the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, MIT, to pursue a PhD at the age of 22. He created his own semiconductor research firm at the age of 27. At the age of 30, his business created the first set of electronic chips, which created quite a stir in the industry. He has received honors such as the 35 Scientific and Technological Innovators Under 35 Years Old Award from Fortune China, the 40 Business Elites Under 40 Years Old Award from Fortune China, and the 2018 China AI Hero List Business Emerging Award. He is known as China's light chaser in the semiconductor sector. In this issue, Zia's childish persona G will introduce everyone to Shinichen, the super physics genius. The light chaser advances on the target. Shinichen was born in 1989 in Hangzhou, Zhejiang, China. He excelled academically since childhood and was accepted into Hangzhou Foreign Language School after graduating from elementary school. He worked hard in school and developed his own physics knowledge system. Following that, he was admitted to Nanyang Technological University in Singapore to study physics, and he went on to study as a PhD student at Johns Hopkins University in the United States. Shen Chen was suggested for a PhD at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology when he was 22 years old, and he began studying nanophotonics. Optics, optical engineering, electrical engineering, and nanotechnology are all part of nanophotonics. One of its applications is the replacement of photons for electronics and more contemporary components for old components in data processing equipment. During his PhD studies, he once again shown exceptional intellectual abilities. He secured 10 patents and published 15 articles with exceptional outcomes. At the same time, everyone refers to him as a light chaser because of his persistence and conscientiousness in optical research. He gained a more comprehensive and in-depth grasp of the whole semiconductor business during his studies at MIT. He is well aware that chip fabrication has long been a stuck neck in my country's technical growth. My country's chip technology began later than that of industrialized countries. Although the rate of development is rather quick, the sector often lacks the technology and production capacity to keep up. Other difficulties include a lack of technical personnel. He had been paying attention to the growth of domestic chip technology since he was in college, and he was resolved to give his own power to the development of Chinese chips. He has always studied hard and strived for the same in his heart. Shinichen stated that the increase of data consumption would accelerate over the next 10 years, but the expansion of electronic chips will be moderate. The most difficult problem in this sector will be determining how to properly match the two. An article titled Angle Selection for Broadband Optics was published in the journal Science in 2014. Shin Yichen is the paper's first author. He recognized the material scale option of light propagation direction, which earned him a great reputation for a time. Shin Chen began his entrepreneurship path after graduating from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology. Shin Chen established Shiji Technology, a photonic chip startup, in the United States in 2016. He received first prize in the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, MIT, entrepreneurship competition in 2017 with his own invention of the world's first photonic chip prototype board. He earned first place in the Harvard University Innovation Challenge competition immediately after and effectively shocked the industry. Insiders in the industry praised this brilliant teenager's accomplishment in the realm of photonic chips. The magic of controlling the photonic chip is laudable. 
In 2018, Shiji Technology, which had only been in operation for less than two years, got backing from major corporations. Baidu and American semiconductor giants invested up to $10 million in the startup. People from all walks of life in the country have also taken notice to this young teenager's breakthrough achievements in the field of chips and have great hopes of him to solve the problem of chip challenges. On March 23, 2018, the U.S. levied a series of heinous sanctions on China, the majority of which were carried by Huawei. Huawei is a Fortune 500 corporation, and its 5G technology is at the forefront of the global market. To stifle China's progress in new technologies, the U.S. placed sanctions on Huawei in a variety of methods, including prohibiting American businesses from making chips for Huawei and prohibiting Huawei from acquiring chips created by foreign manufacturers utilizing American technology. This action caused a big issue for Huawei. Indeed, Huawei has the capacity to manufacture semiconductors, but it also needs ARM to supply architecture on high-end CPUs. We have our own Da Vinci architecture in the field of terminal chips at the moment. However, in the current circumstances, the weakness of Chinese chips is that China's chip technology cannot be developed to a high-end level without lithography machinery. Due to many U.S. barriers, the prospect of importing the 7 nanometer process lithography machine into China is essentially nil. As a result, we must find other methods of developing our own chips. Moving into the realm of photonic chips is currently a well-recognized development route in China. Shinichen Chen stated that optical chips are more suited for manual computations than electronic processors, and that photonic chips waste less energy and are quicker. Shinichen Chen is now conducting extensive research on optical chips and continues to produce outstanding research outcomes. His study has uncovered new photon computing application scenarios, attracting leading worldwide organizations such as Google, Facebook, AWS, and BAT. Shinichen Chen received the 2018 China AI Heroes Billboard Business Innovation Figure Award for his exceptional technological advancements and economic impact in the AI industry. The title of magician who controls photonic chips was also obtained. In addition, he was named one of the 35 technological innovations under 35 and one of the Fortune China 40 business elites under 40 by Fortune China. Reporting to the country from an early age will become an important tool in the future. If Shinichen's photonic chip research is successful in the future, it will not only be a major breakthrough in the field of chips, but it will also bring revolutionary changes to the development of the entire industry, as well as the most powerful proof of my country's national strength, under the premise of foreign technology blockade. We utilize our strength to express our conviction in an obligation to become a technologically powerful country. The international situation is now difficult. Western countries, led by the United States, are blind to China's rise. They are attempting to rewrite history by restricting China in many spheres and impeding its progress. And it is through the unwavering struggle and research of young scientists like Shinichen Chen in frontier sectors that our country can repeatedly break through other countries' technology embargo and begin on the path of rejuvenation of a mighty country. Young individuals inspire others to commit themselves to research and to fearlessly forge new paths dreams are horses on the way to pursuing light, and they will eventually serve the country. He would not be where he is now if the family had not encouraged Shin Chen's first interest in physics and had not enabled him to begin on the path of physics studies. If God gave Shin Chen a skill above ordinary people and allowed him to progress along the path of science, he would not be where he is now without his faith and love. Genius is nothing but a love of job and work process, as the phrase goes. People with the brightest minds in the world, such as Shin Chen, are working hard to follow the light, so why shouldn't each of us regular people? Many young people nowadays choose to lay flat, have low aspirations for their lives, and have lost the will to strive in battle. Intelligence is found in diligence, and genius is found in accumulation. We can learn at the end of this film that China's optical chip hope. Shin Chen is a chip genius. I hope that every one of us may begin right now by studying hard, focusing on accumulating, laying a firm foundation for our future, and working relentlessly to become a better version of ourselves. Were Shin Chen's actions inspiring to you? Thanks for watching our video. We would appreciate it if you subscribed our channel and gave us a thumb. See you.